Steven! Get the fuck out here! We're doing a sequel! What is it now? Oh, there you are, He-Man. I've been here the whole time. The alarm? Oh, yeah, sorry, let me just, um... So, what's going on? This! Manji laid off workers! Wait, didn't this happen, like, six months ago? No, it happened again! I haven't even reset the counter. And you're telling me that we now have to specify which layoffs you're talking about. Yep! And this time, it's worse! 220 Bungie developers were laid off! More than double than last time! One of them, a week before her maternity leave! Double kill. But wait, I thought the final shape was a success. Surely that would have prevented further layoffs. The final shape sold worse than lightful. Oh. And somehow, it gets worse! How does it get worse? Well, buckle up, buckaroo! Here's how! Pete Barson, CEO of Bungie, was found out to have spent $2.3 million buying vintage fucking cars out of the Sony acquisition, the same Sony acquisition that was done to prevent layoffs from his factory. And look how well that ended up, but don't worry, because Bungie is working on multiple different incubation projects that are siphoning money from the only thing in the company that's actually making any fucking money. Whoops, I'm glad the old just got canned. So long time senior thing that just left the company, but don't worry, Disney D will still get updates. Just no longer major expansions, but smaller content packs. If you don't like how episodes turned out, then oh god! Hey, remember Marathon? Even an I and guess what sentiment around it's not great! Release day, who fucking knows? Hey, remember Pete's British car finish? He's got a whole collection, you should come over and check it out. By the way, you're fired! The same people who got the biggest mess are still in charge. The future of Deadly 2, as we know, is absolutely f fucked! Well, that's not great. Mm hmm. So the situation is worse than we imagined. And more fucked than we hoped. Damn, if only there was some way we could contact Bungie directly and ask them exactly what's going on. I don't think this is gonna work. You'll be fine. You still use Skype. Yes, yeah, so what? Hello? Hello, hello? Yes, hello, is this Bungie? Yes, you've reached Bungie. Where dreams come to die. Yes, hello, hi. I'm calling today because I want to speak to the dickhead in charge. Ha, huh, Pete? Sure, but can I ask what the call is regarding? I think... He knows. Can you be a bit more specific, sir? Fine. I want to know why he thinks it's okay to spend $2.3 million buying vintage fucking cars when his company is crumbling around him. Sir, I assure you Pete is very upset about this unfortunate situation. Did you not read the recent twit? No, I didn't read the trap. Maybe because you didn't fucking make one. Oh, shit, yeah, we fired the guy made those. What I meant to say, sir, was the new path for Bungie. What? You mean that jizz rag of a manifesto about how he's a continuous source of inspiration, yes. And look, it took a lot of strength for Pete to make that. He had to, like, open ChatGPT and then... Well, at least tell me, now that since the company is literally burning to the ground, will leadership take any pay cuts so that they can try and prevent further layoffs? Ah, uh, sorry, Bungie is not that type of company? Well, then I want to speak to your manager. Okay, just give me a second to transfer your call, and they've just been laid off. What? So who's steering the ship? I have no idea. What? Ah, uh, sir, looks like I've just been called into an HR meeting. I'll just be a second. I'll just put you on hold. Now, it. hang on a second, all right? I... <laughs> Damn it! So, how's it going? What do you fucking think? Uh, hello, sir. Are you still there? Y yes, hello? Who is this? This is Beast Man at Bungie, where dreams come to die. Beast Man? What the fuck are you doing at Bungie? Where's the other guy? Oh, he was just laid off. Now for the luck, can you please put Pete on the phone? I am sorry, but the person you were just speaking to has just been laid off. If you'd like to hear about Pete's totally bitching car collection, press... Damn it! It's a layoff orgy over there! Heavy sigh. If only there was a game that was just like Destiny 2 that we could play instead. What if I told you there is? Impossible. You're telling me there's a looter shooter with mindless grinding, a terrible new user experience, mediocre gameplay, and a story that's impossible to follow without finding some law guy on the internet to tell you what's going on? Mm -hmm. You're bullshitting me. Surely nothing so similarly average could possibly exist. Could it? Wow! It's so bland and mediocre! 
So tell me, when does the game get good? See, that's the great part, it doesn't. Wow, it really is just Destiny 2. It's perfect. <laughs>